I am full bright, sworn protector of the land of Hertfordshire, and beacon of hope for humanity, and I'm here to strike you down. Hello, Fulbright. My name is Cataclysm. I know exactly who you are, arch-villain Cataclysm, Lord of all and known as the Blackened. That's heavy. Your ego cannot bear the heavy weight and will crumble under itself, becoming your undoing. Evil demon, your day of reckoning has finally arrived. I will be the one to best you in combat. Ooh, don't know about that one. What's your ability? Ha! As if I would reveal my powers to a villain such as you. That's worth a shot. Do you want to know mine? I... Yes. I would only reveal my ability to the strongest, and you are clearly not of the strongest, you are clearly of the weakest. You killed my father. I'm here to avenge the legacy you spat upon. You don't belong in this world, monster. Oh, your words are so hurtful. You say I'm a monster? Name one villainous thing that I've done. In fact, no, name a hundred. Name a hundred villainous things that I've done. Go ahead, you can't. You think yourself funny. Would it help you to know that you're dead already? You were as soon as you took one step into the room. I won't fall for your traps. Who says you haven't already? Are you scared, Fulbright? I've long since banished fear of you, ever since I trained to be a hero. My teacher, makes you rest, told me stories about you. Whether they be true or not, they mean nothing to me. Whether you're hellspawn or not, you're still just flesh and blood at my hand. Oh Christ, I thought villains were meant to be the monologuing ones. I don't know what your teacher said of me, Fulbright, sworn protector of Bumble upon Tweedledink or whatever it was. I don't know what your teacher said about me. But I can honestly say, I really don't care. I know who I am and what I'm capable of. I mean, when a story's ever like the real thing. So I'll ask you again. Are you scared? Bingo! God, there's a bunch of dirt or something in my water. I haven't cleaned the bottom in ages and it's showing. Your thing works on water, doesn't it? One of the few liquids I can do, pass it here. Thank you. Want to go over the plan once more? Yeah, sure. When Catacooks goes on one of his walks, I'll distract him while you survey his base. He leaves the door unlocked, yeah? Should do. And you sure he'll speak with you? He has no reason to hurt me if I don't pose a threat to him. I'll make sure of it. Good timing. I'll make my way up to his room, give you as much time as possible.
准备。Catch a glimpse. Full title, please. Archvillain Cataclips, Lord of All and known as the Blackened. Speaking. My name is Logan, and I'm here to talk to you. Nice to meet you, Logan. Talk about what? Anything at all. When's the last time you had any sort of real conversation? <sighs> Not really sure I know what that is. Most people tried to kill me off the introduction. Hang on, I swear I recognise you. I just want to get to know you a little bit more. Tell me about something. <laughs> what specifically? Anything at all. What's on your mind? Uh, I've been thinking about... I've been thinking about plants a lot. I really like plants. I know it's not exactly on brand, but... Uh, I like plants been thinking about doing something with it one day. Like what? Like traveling to South America at some point, visiting a rainforest. I love rainforests. But I've never been. Might be nice. That's interesting. I wouldn't have guessed that. Well, of course you wouldn't. Not would even know any true things about me really. Just kind of the general stuff. But what about you, Logan? What's your story? What's up with you? What do you want to know? <laughs> Just the general stuff. Where are you going? Where are you from? I travel alone. I'm here representing myself and only myself. You said you recognised me earlier. That's because I'm actually the fourth most famous practicing magician in the world. When the world woke up with powers all that time ago, I found I could do this. My ability allows me to separate objects, mainly solids, into their different original components. This soil from an old house nearby is made up of mulch, organic material, water, and trace amounts of lead paint. PLS can be very dangerous in the right hands. I call my ability solid to substance. That's heavy. But you said you were a magician? Fourth most popular acting magician in the world. This is my act. Do people know you're using your ability? Nope. They think I'm just like any other illusionist. But you're like actually doing magic. How are you not the best in the world? Sometimes the illusion is more believable than reality. But about your ability. For such a prominent villain, you managed to keep it under wraps for a very long time now. And I intend to keep it that way. Understandable. But you live in such isolation. Why do it at the fear of so many? 
Well, if the power exists, then someone has to, don't they? That's not my philosophy. And because it's fun. I was gifted this power, and I'm going to enjoy it. And if anyone tries to stop me, that's them getting in the way. And that's their problem. I'd recommend you reconsider. But it's about time I make my leave. Where are you going? Not sure yet. I travel around a lot. But the conversation's been filling. Likewise. Logan? Venom? Did you meet him? Of course I did. You found his room? Absolutely. We had a talk. His guard was up, but he was definitely a little more trusting of me. Hmm. What about his ability? He wasn't budging, but I have a lead. There was a piece of paper. He kept writing something at several points in the conversation. I'm betting his ability has something to do with that. Did you see what he was writing? The motion of his hand was kind of crossing something off. Might be a conditional thing. Only actuates when certain parameters have been met, and he's checking them off. Hmm. Interesting. I used phantom pain to scout out his room. Simple layout, a desk, a few miscellaneous objects, but nothing strange from what I could feel. If he sits at his desk, then he's pretty cornered. Let's go from there and make a plan. Catacalypse. Logan? I was about to move on to other places when I thought I'd stop by for one last visit. I realise it's not every day I get to be the Lord of All, so why not spend as much time as I can? I never have a visitor here for more than five minutes. They usually leave in a body bag after then. Ah, that's too bad for them. Hope that won't be me. I do have a lot of chairs. Can I offer you some water? I don't drink anything given to me by anyone. You can't think I'm that careless. What, because it might be poisoned? I can show you it's not. See? <sighs> Nothing in it. Can I see? Thank you, but I'm fine. You've got some nerve if you think I trust anyone. So what are we talking about? I was interested in our conversation earlier where you said no one leaves this room after five minutes alive. Don't worry, I'm not going to ask what your ability is, but is it really that powerful? It is unfortunately strong, yes. I'm unbeatable, but it means I lack a challenge. I have yet to meet a worthy opponent. Must be lonely. No one who can match you. Not lonely, no. It's quite freeing. It's actually quite nice to live life just for enjoyment. It's very hedonistic. I don't have to worry about repercussions or expectations or responsibilities because I'm untouchable. Mm -hmm.
Don't even think about making a move. This salt is cesium chloride. If you try anything, I'll use solid to substance to separate the chemical makeup and be left with pure cesium, which is extremely reactive with water. Wouldn't want an explosion in such close proximity now, would we? The leftover chloride is also a pretty potent gas. That was pretty heavy. Can I ask how you did that? My name is Venom, and my ability Phantom Pain allows me to project my sense of touch into another space. I can't move objects, but the sensation of contact is there for both sides. And you two are yet another bunch of wannabe heroes intent on taking me down? Anyone ever got this far before? Good point. I've been looking for a challenge. What's your ability? Ooh, can't answer that one, I'm afraid. Evil with your little, uh, exploding magic trick over there. Oh, I get it. You're not here to kill me to liberate anyone or anything. You two are here to discover my ability. Contracted for it, maybe? We're asking the questions here. Oh, that's thoroughly disappointing. Because I wanted a good fight. But if you really want to know, I could always give a visual demonstration. I could blow us all up in less than a second. Time's usually on my side. Things just always happen to work out in the end. Venom! Time splitter. My ability, Time Splitter, allows me to reorder the events of the previous five minutes with actions and consequences changing based on context. As your friend here so politely demonstrated, I am untouchable. But I am impressed with your work here today, leaving me this vulnerable. So just say the word, and I'll let you go. Maybe it's time for the world to find out about my ability. Maybe it's what I need. What? I'm serious. Don't make me change my mind. Venom, let's go. I don't trust him. Yeah, I don't think we have a choice and we have what we need. She's right, you really can't. But I guarantee I'm being honest with you. Go now, do whatever you have to do. And maybe we'll meet again someday. Or you could try and best the editing of reality itself. I still think we should have tried to fight. My job was to fight his ability, nothing more. But it would have been the right thing to do. We would have died. So we live with regret? Either way, at least we stay a team. We're both alive and I'll never regret that. Now we can reveal his ability to the world and defeat him while still living. What if he tries to get away? Know what I know of him? he never try that. Oh, hi guys. I was just on my way out. You two are still here? Where are you going? Away from here. Maybe a rainforest or something. What? Well, I've just had a big change and I don't really know how it's going to go and uh, I'm going to enjoy it. See you around.